think people will think this must be a, a very detailed project. Indeed, I'll tell you an interesting story. When we first began this project, some woman came up and said that she would like to chair this. And I said, well, there's not much to chair. All there is is simply a basket that is simply put in the back of the church. And uh, people pass by the basket. We oftentimes say to pretend that that basket is Jesus. And we can walk by and do nothing. We can walk by and put our dollar or two or 50 cents a day. All we can simply walk by and offer a prayer for the poor. That basket reminds our people of Christ in the world today. And people usually come on Sundays and will put their donation in. But during the week they do the same thing. But there is very little, if any, um, bureaucracy or effort other than putting the basket out and counting the monies that come in and depositing them in the bank. And after Lent, we bring the check down to food for the poor. Um, I think we're prone to think that everything has to have a chairman, a vice chairman. All it has to do is, most importantly, it has to have a pastor who has a love for the poor. And hopefully a pastor who has visited um, Haiti or a third world country and knows firsthand their destitution. Because then we speak with more conviction. If the pastor speaks with conviction, then the people will certainly be moved.